was a little girl, I would brush and brush my dolls. And I asked my mom if I could have a Yorkie that I could brush the hair. They're not like a dog. They're like a little person. Each one of them has their own specific personality. Some people say, oh, they're yappy little dogs. No, there are some yappy people, ah! and there's some non-yappy people. Well, just like a Yorkie. I think that people believe they're getting this little toy dog that's just going to sit there and look pretty, and that's a big illusion. They're feisty. Yorkshire Terriers are really a bit stubborn. They're sneaky, but the squirrels are faster. She hasn't caught one yet. <laughs> they're basically our terriers, and they'll dig like heck. Nowadays, Yorkies are considered a glamour dog. Um, that's the reason I bought him. I sell my Yorkshire Terry puppies mostly to ladies, and I always get a call from my husband a week later. I can't believe it's a big breed and a little package. There are some Yorkshire Terriers that will sit on your lap very peacefully, but the minute something's going on, if they saw a mouse or another dog in their house, they'd be off like a shot. I've had her on my lap, and a golden retriever came up. She bit him in the nose. <laughs> Well, Yorkies travel well because they're typically quiet when you're traveling with them. We go to the mall together and I leave him with Gypsy. She's a chick magnet. The original breed came from England. They were used to be ratters. They were bred to take into the coal mines. That's why they have the gold head, the gold front, and the gold rear. If you can see the dog coming at you or going away from you, it's not a rat. Yorkies seem to know rodents very well, and anything that falls in that family is subject to being chased. If you notice, we use the little rats to get their attention. Squeaky toys, it's basically the rat. The signature mark of the Yorkshire Terrier is the coat. Yorkies don't have fur like other dogs. It's more like our hair. So we call it a hypoallergenic dog because it tends to have less dander. Health and welfare is very, very important. If you love your dog, you'll feed good nutrition, won't you? You have to have the bone structure, you have to have the coat texture, you have to have the internal health, and this all is attributed to what you feed the dog. The nutrition is the vital part of growing the coat. 90% of our breed is coat, so we have to have great nutrition in order to have good growth. I have a lot of pride in my breed and I've every confidence in Yukonuba. The breed specific formula that Yukonuba has for Yorkies has the correct omega, fatty acids, zinc, and copper. The combination of the three keeps you from having the flakes. It's designed to nourish healthy skin, maintain a beautiful coat, and for overall health. Yorkies have the same amount of teeth as all dogs have. Same amount of teeth but put in a small mouth. Dogs do not like their teeth brushed. And if they're eating a good, firm kibble that is small enough for them, that really reduces tartar. They enjoy biting, they enjoy chewing, which helps scrape the outside of the tooth, which helps with tartar. They have to like it. I have so many people that will come up and say, I can't get my dog to eat. And I tell them, go get yourself a bag of Yukonuba, and I guarantee you, your dog will start eating. Most dog foods, you open a bag and you go, this, you open the bag and it's like, hmm, smells pretty good. And if anybody happens to leave a crumb in their bowl of their Yukonuba, Maggie cleans it up for them. The size of the dog kibble is one of the best things because I don't have to break it apart. My Yorkies have never liked a really large food. They seem to have a problem biting. The breed-specific formula has smaller bites for our smaller dogs. I figure a company that does a lot of research knows a lot more than I'll ever figure out to make the food healthy for the dog. You can't help but love all the Yorkies, but of course this one is the best. <laughs> they will do just about anything for you, and all you have to do is reward them with love. My dogs have been the joy of my life. The Yorkies are very addictive, they're fun to have, they're amusing. They are great little dogs. Maggie is my heart and soul. I love my Maggie. I truly am passionate about this breed. Every day, every hour with a Yorkie is an adventure. I've devoted my whole life to them. It, it cost me a husband somewhere along the way. I'm the best girl in all the world. I love her with all my heart. She's my little girl.